Hello and welcome back to Chef Keisha's Kitchen. I am Keisha and um, today I'm going to be making a coconut pie recipe. Um, if you're watching this channel, please like, subscribe, comment, and share this video. Okay, I had a raffle on Facebook this week. I was so excited about that. And um, I'm just giving away three desserts. One of the desserts was a coconut pie, the other was a 7-Up cake, and the other was a pineapple upside down cake. So I'm going to be making all three of those desserts today. Um, the winner of the coconut pie was Jasmine Collins. And this is actually the pie that I'm making right now. I got the recipe from my aunt um, who adds a little secret ingredient to her coconut pie. And I'm going to show you what that is in just a minute. So we're going to go ahead and get started. The first thing we have is a cup of sugar. Sugar. A tablespoon, two tablespoons of all-purpose flour. A half a cup of butter, which is one stick. Three eggs. One teaspoon of vanilla, a cup of milk, two and a half cups of sweetened coconut flakes. Make sure they're sweetened coconut flakes. And then the secret ingredient to my aunt pie, she always added um, a two tablespoons of fresh um, lemon juice. So I took a lemon, squeezed it out, and I'm going to take two tablespoons for that. I have my handy mixer here and we'll go ahead and get everything, all the ingredients in and get started. But the first thing you need to do is add, make sure that your oven is set at 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, that's already done and it's already preheating. Okay, I have my flour here. I'm going to add my flour. My two tablespoons of um, flour. I just added sugar. Two tablespoons of flour. And I'm going to go ahead and get that incorporated. Just mix it up a little bit, break up the flour a little bit, get it incorporated with the sugar. The next we're going to add in is my butter. So that looks good. So now I'm going to add in my one stick of butter. And then once this is incorporated, I'm going to take off the bowl so that you all can see what it looks like, what it's supposed to look like. So you're just creaming the flour, the sugar, and the butter together. It's supposed to come together as like a creamy, creamy soft mixture. I've been making this coconut recipe for about, I would say, 12 years. I used to make it without the, um, without the lemon. So what's what I showed you how to told me what her secret ingredients were. I just had to add the lemon to it because I tasted hers and it was so good. It's that little extra um, zing of flavor that just brightens up the, um, the pie. I also have a pie shell here. I didn't say that, but a pie shell. This is a deep dish pie shell, by the way. It's already, I just bought it. I use, I, sometimes I make my own pie shell and this time I just want a pie shell. Okay. And this is what it looks like. Okay. All creamed together. Alright. So now, I'm going to put this back in here. Put my power back on. And I'm going to add my eggs. Start my mixer. And I'm going to add my eggs one at a time. One. Two. And three. Give it a clean as we go. Put everything away. Okay. Then we're going to add our vanilla extract. One tablespoon of vanilla extract. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. Scraping the sugar off the 
bottom of the bowl. And then I'm going to put it right back here. You can use a spatula for that too. But the less dishes you messed up, the better. Right? Okay. You think that better incorporate? That's what it looks like so far. And that's just the flour, the sugar, the butter, the eggs, and the vanilla. Okay? And we're going to finish it. Okay. Just back on here. Now the next thing we're going to add is our coconut. Always make sure you wash your hands before you start cooking. Coconut. And we're going to add my milk. And next I'm going to add two tablespoons of about I would say about 30 to 45 minutes more so like 45 minutes but you just it's going to get a little brown on top and it's going to rise up a little bit and what, but once you take it up it's going to take it out though um, oven is going to settle back down so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and put this pie in the oven and then I'm going to come back and show you halfway through what it looks like and then I'm going to show you the end product so I'll be back soon okay I'm back I'm this chef Keisha with Chef Keisha's Kitchen. I'm also back with the coconut pie that I made earlier. Um, here's the results of it. Isn't it beautiful? I wish I could slice it and eat it, but I can't. Just like I said earlier, I did a raffle this week and I had three winners. One of the winners was Jasmine Collins and she won this coconut pie. I drew her name on Wednesday and she won this coconut pie. So congratulations, Jasmine. I hope you enjoy your pie and um, Please follow me on on um, Facebook, on Instagram, Chef Keisha's Kitchen. The name is both that the same um, on Facebook as well as Instagram. Follow me because I may be having some more drawings and some of the things that I do make. I can actually ship them. Um, ship so make sure you follow me just in case I have some more drawings but anyway this is going to Jasmine's co Jasmine Collins I thank you all so much for watching once again please like share subscribe and, or co and comment to the to my page below and I will have some information in the description page it's some links to other um, desserts that I'm making today as well as the ingredients to this delicious pie I know Jasmine's going to enjoy so please 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 like share comment and subscribe till next time peace